Hey you guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. So it's your girl Devin K. So for today's video, you guys, I have a modeling class. It is a runway class. So I'm just going to show you guys um, what I have to wear. I'll take you to the agency with me and I will record as much footage as possible so you guys can see what I'm up to for my modeling journey. Okay, you guys, so I'm in the car. I'm getting ready to leave to go to my agency. Um, this is basically what I'm wearing. It's a black tank top, and then I have on black skinny jeans. And because it's a tank top, I wore a little hoodie over it and then gold accessories. Um, so where my agency is now, I've never been to the new location. It moved after like um, COVID and everything. So this is my first time going to the new location. Um, so I'm gonna get, like I said, as much footage for you guys as I can. And we still have to wear like face masks and stuff. So I didn't put on like any makeup. I just like put on mascara and did my eyebrows. And I'm just gonna go like this because I'm gonna have to wear a mask the whole time. So my whole face is gonna be covered. So I will check in with you guys when I arrive okay you guys what's up so i'm at the agency the parking lot is super little it's like a lot lot smaller than what it is the last one was at the front of neck and this one is like someone somewhere totally different so like i'm gonna show you guys the parking lot but you can't really see that much All right, so now it is time for me to get ready to go inside. So I have a notebook to take notes because I just like to learn as much as I can about modeling. So I have that. And then I am going to put my heels on. I did not wear them when driving, of course, but it's always best to go to like your class if they ask you to wear heels or like a casting to walk in with heels. So I'm gonna open And then them. of course my heels that I will be wearing. These are my heels that I wear on the runway. So I always practice in these. Hey you guys, so I'm back from class. So the name of this class was Run Runway in D6 and I showed you guys the little clip of the room. I couldn't really record that much because they don't like cameras in there and like I want to get other people in the video without their permission just to avoid any complications or anything. So what we did was we practiced our runway walk. So um, she had us line up and then I showed you guys that carpet. That was basically our runway. And she had everyone just do a walk. Like, what do you feel your model walk is? Then she gave us pointers and showed us like how our posture should be. Um, Chin should just be, you know, level, chest up and out, shoulders back, and then you kind of need to lean. And then she also said that if when you're walking, if you do not have a pain in like the, or pressure in the like arch of your back, then your posture for your walk is not right. Um, she also went over like how your arms should move. So when you're walking, you shouldn't be like swinging your arms like this. And then after we practice our individual walks for a while and she taught us the model stance, um, your model stance when you hit the runway, um, then we did some different types of walks. So we did singles where we just walked the runway by ourselves, And then we did something called a single spotlight. So it's when you walk halfway down the runway, you stop in the middle, you do three poses, and then you continue to the end of the runway, you do three more poses, and then you walk back. You don't stop in the middle um, on the way back. And then we did doubles. Now this is where it got kind of harder because you have to walk with a partner. So she tried to match us up by like size and height. Um, and then we did, so the doubles, we did just a runway walk there and back. And you have to keep in step and pace with your partner. So you have to be looking at them out of the peripheral, but you still have to be like making eye contact with the crowd as well. And then you do your poses at the end. You both have to turn at the same time. So even though you're doing your own signal signature poses, you still have to be aware of like your partner right there. 
and then you walk back. Then we did something called double spotlight. So it was where one of we would walk the runway together, one of us we would choose which one before we hit the runway would stop in the middle. You do three poses while your partner goes down and finishes walking the runway. And you just honestly, you have to pose until they come pick you up. So sometimes it's three poses, sometimes you have to do six or eight, but you're just posing in the middle of the runway. And then they will come and they will pick you up and you will continue to exit the runway and then you'll swap. So that was basically like what we practiced it, practice in class. I'm sorry, you guys, I couldn't get you more footage, but that's just pretty much what we went over. Um, you wanna know your points of focus for the runway. So like what areas the crowd will be, what are spotlight areas. Um, and then turns, if you do a circle, you wanna slow it down. Um, practice until you feel comfortable. And then facial, um, we talked about like the makeup and makeup looks and things. She told us like never change your makeup, how they did it for you. Um, if you don't really like it, she was like, maybe you can get away with like putting on eyeliner or something. But other than that, she was like, don't touch your makeup. Um, and then we talked about like how you would prep for a fashion show. So like the runway bag, what you would have in there, um, shoes, a triangle toe, three to three and a half inches, um, no peep toe, black, multiple pairs of black heels. Um, you wanna have a Mary Jane, a platform, a peep toe, a pump, a nude pair, a clear pair, and then one clue, one um, pair of shoes with a pop of color and you would just ask the designer if they wanted color what their preference would be and then we talked about like what you would bring so you always want to bring snacks and food and water to a runway show because you don't know how long you have to be there your casting call can be hours um, I had a situation where I had to be somewhere at like one o'clock and I didn't walk till 11 p.m. at night so I was stuck in a room for like 10 hours with people I didn't know and yeah, it was crazy. And then um, what type of clothes should you pack in the model bag? So you should bring panties, of course, you wanna have nude and black, a tank, black, white and nude, jeans, black or plain, a denim, no holes. Um, you can bring a white button down shirt. And then bring always your own foundation and eyeliner, even if they tell you makeup is provided because you don't know how good or how experienced the makeup artist may be that they have there. So you guys, that was just my runway on my weekend vlog for my modeling class. I don't really post modeling content, but my title on this channel is Devin K the Model. So I figured since I did a modeling thing, I would share it, to you, share it with you guys and just kind of turn it into a vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see more of this content. And everybody safe, safe, happy, positive, and productive. Until next time from Devin K.